Doesn't matter how much of an asshole someone in this game is, I will still save them. If it means I'll get a trophy for it. Trophies are more important than loyalty. Buttons? What buttons? It's quick time event, I bet. Yep, yeah. okay, thought so. Seems to be X every time. You're not gonna change the squeal triangle? Nope, okay. If it bleeds, I can kill it. Uh okay. <laughs> Julia, where are we going? I need to find Morikawa Sensei. He'll know what to do. Who's that? Morikawa Sensei. He's my sensei. A sensei. Makes sense. But like a teacher? I didn't know you spoke Japanese, Nick. Well, I what's <laughs> I can't speak Japanese, Juliet. I just know that one word. Aww. Wait, that, it says chop the shop dot zom. How do I use it? Is that an indication that there's a shop nearby, or I could have used the shop when it popped up? You know, at random times throughout this game, there's just a, like, for no reason at all, a bunch of flashy lights go off all around her. Like all these fireworks, and most of the, well, it has a reason, I guess. But most of the time, I have no idea why it's happening. Like earlier, when I finished that quick time event, just at random times, your character just has a bunch of fireworks going off. It's cool though. I like it. Pretty crazy game. Smashy, smashy. Is there some sort of library? Time... Zombie basketball. Hey, let's do this. I'm not a fan of basketball. Just saying. Okay. Only score three pointers. Okay. I tried to... Huh? I just pressed triangle. I don't know how I did that. Can I take out more than one? Okay, that's pretty cool. Let's wait for them to bunch up. Oh, uh, I think that's good enough. Triple. Not bad, not bad. Wait, health. Is that guy trying to catch the heads? The guy jumping up and down there? Oh, yeah, yeah, he is. Hang on, I'm gonna kill him. Here we go. Two minutes left. We're over a third of the way there anyway. Almost half. Yeah, we'll do this in no time. No problem. Already at 50. Okay, good. I assume we only need a hundred, since the opposing team have a hundred points. Okay, no. this is making the situation a bit more tricky. Adding two guys. Wow, what's up with those cheerleaders? Are they bad? Like, are they zombies? Okay, I think they were. Damn. Okay, dodge. My health's getting low. Got plenty of time and only a few more points are needed. My guy keeps blocking them. Here we go, we're done. Wow, what a turnaround. The zombies are getting slaughtered. Incredible game, Juliet. Can't wait to see you in action again. Good. We really need that lollipop. Where's that voice coming from? The best 
Okay, I actually need to kind of think about my health now. If I see a store, I need, really need to buy some. Kind of low. You're dead. Ah, perfect. Speaking of shops... Okay, that'll do. Uh, what's this? Sh increase strength. Nick shake. Two cheer attacks followed by a penetrating chain sword thrust. Okay, sure. All right, square, square, triangle. I can remem remember that. Square, square, triangle. Okay, I guess you need to do it on a zone. Wait. All right, I'm going to set up this once and for all. Options. How do you use your phone? Okay, I'm going to look in the manual for a second. Okay, I just learned two things. One, the manual of this game is atrociously, offensively bad, for, you know, for starters. I mean, it's not as if I really look into, it's not a big deal, because, like, I don't even use the manuals of games, like, you know, 90% of the games I own, I haven't even looked in the manual, so it's not a big deal. Like, it's only because of this, it's only because I don't know how to use the phone, I looked in the manual anyway, otherwise I never would have looked in it in my whole entire life. But Jesus, it's bad. I mean, I live in the UK, so I have the PAL version of the game. So maybe the N, uh, the NTSC version of the game has a different manual. But as for us, guys, we have a pretty bad manual, let's just say. I mean, it's literally like five pages long. It's pretty bad. Um, and also, it doesn't say anything about the phone, so I had to Google it. Uh, so the second thing I learned is how to use the phone. And I typed into Google um, how to use phone in, and the, me the second result, the, the second most searched result was Lollipop Chainsaw. So it was how to use phone in Lollipop Chainsaw was the second most searched result in Google. And the first result was in GTA 4, which uh, that's kind of weird. I mean, it's pretty obvious how to use the phone in GTA 4, but whatever. Okay, it turns out you, go to, you don't use it in game. You go to the pause menu, click on Juliet's stash, Wait for it to load. And there we go. Uh, what? Okay, they're, they're supposed to... Oh, here we... Are these on? Oh, wait, that's the zombie album. Oh, here we go. This is the phone. Okay. Oh, wait, we already listened to that one. I think that was at the start of the game. Like, doing the short cutscene. Hey, it's Mom, Juliet. Hope you're taking care of yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, I think we listened to this one, too. I think we listened. No, did we? I don't. We definitely didn't listen to this one. Juliet, it's mom. I know it's silly, but I've been shopping online all day. I can't believe I used to be afraid to give out my credit card number online. Boy, it's really addictive. I'm bad for your finance. All right, let's bounce. Uh, right. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, one more thing before we get into the action. I have missed some people, apparently. Apparently, I let some people die and I haven't even noticed them. Oh well. We can kiss goodbye to that Save Everyone trophy. By the way, I don't know if there's actually a Save Everyone trophy. I'm just assuming there is one because, well, why wouldn't there be? I mean, duh. That's just how the trophy lists go, you know? You, you just know there'll be a trophy like that. And I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure I'm right. I'm confident that I'm right. I would bet money I'm right. Wait. Uh, left. Okay. Nope. Open. What's going on? Fire? 
Okay. Wait, kill who? Oh, these guys. Let's. Wait, yeah, the fire dudes detonate the bomb bombers, right? Yeah, killing. Well, I don't know. Killing live frogs. You know, those suicide bombing dudes aren't too threatening, to be honest. The explosion they give off is actually, like, pretty small, so they're not much of a threat to you. I mean, as long as you're, like, a few centimeters away from them, they won't do any damage to you when they blow up. Wait, I, uh, yeah, I forgot about that. We got a new move. Oh, I bought it, like, ages ago, but... Here we go, that's it. And it kills them instantly. Nice. Not bad at all. Oh, it doesn't kill this guy instantly. I guess it depends how much health you've already taken off them. Oh, quick time events again. The one thing I love, which everybody else hates. Like I can, I, I'm, I can acknowledge the fact that this is really unnecessary, but I kind of enjoy doing it to be honest. I can't help myself. It's a quick time event, so. Like, I enjoy them in Resident Evil 4. And 5. And I can't think of any other quick time event games off the top of my head. Heavy Rain. More cops. Alright, that's it. Whoa, look, oh, look at the health. I'm trying to, I'm pressing R2. Here we go. Put my health down mega fast. God damn. I hope I'm invincible doing this, because my health's really low. Wow. I think that was a waste. I should have saved it for the boss. I can't see this level lasting much longer. Yeah, I know. There's a trophy for that. I saw it earlier. To beat the high scores. Oh, I knew this... The rage thing like runs out just as I come across another batch of zombies. It's to be expected. Oh well. Hey, that that cop was like a mini boss anyway, so I don't regret using it on that boss. Well, mini boss. Ha. Ah. That was pretty awesome. I think I killed those zombies with style there. Wait, what? Oh, here we go. These suicide bombing guys. Ha! What does what does that shop to shop icon appearing on screen mean? Does it mean there's a shop nearby or what? Oh, I just realised he was swinging his axe at me or whatever that is. Looks like a baseball bat. I need to learn to dodge more. Wow, those guys with the guitars are tough. Um, this guy. Okay, I'm not sure what his weak point was. He was at the end of the first stage, weren't he? Like, we don't have any projectiles we can throw at the enemies. Oh, God. Okay. Oh wait, he's almost dead. Not too bad. That's actually pretty easy. Really, the only thing I did was just press triangle all the time. 